It's so nice to come here and just relax. I mean, Goa is a kind of a place where you come and relax, but to truly relax. A relaxation that doesn't require doing something and then the result will be to relax. Just relaxing naturally as we are right now. This is, uh, yeah, this is really great. And relaxing as open intelligence. And what is open intelligence? <laughs> if, we, if we are to relax as that, we need to know what open intelligence is. And we can be introduced to that right now. And we can stop thinking just for a moment. And recognize what remains. That's it. Open intelligence. Open intelligence that knows everything, that senses everything, that's hearing these words. Open intelligence that, has the qu that knows the question, how can I rest in all situations? How can I recognize open intelligence all the time? Open intelligence is always on. And we can get to know that by this simple practice of short moments. So we can take these short moments of recognizing open intelligence throughout our day. We can take short moments whilst playing the guitar. We can take short moments whilst having a shower, whilst eating our favorite food, whilst eating our least favorite food, whilst feeling great about ourselves and whilst feeling we're just nothing. We don't know what to do with our life. This opportunity to rest naturally, to recognize what remains at the basis of all the experience, the incredible range of experience, we can just go there and rest naturally. And uh, for me, I just had no idea before I met this training that I could even do that. I didn't know, I just didn't know that, the, that relaxation was effortless. I never really felt very relaxed. Just generally, I just didn't feel very relaxed. I always felt quite tense. And, um, and so I really thought I had to do things to relax myself. So I had to do enough exercise. I had to hang out with the right people, chilled out people, people that had no worries, no problems. Um, <clears throat> I had to, yeah, just have have a job that I liked and then I could relax because I liked the job so I could relax and um, be in a relationship because I wasn't relaxed when I wasn't in a relationship so if I'm in a relationship then I could relax and then I discovered actually it was the least relaxing <laughs> for me being in a relationship that was interesting so it's like where do you go where do you go for the relaxation or maybe you come to Goa and the weather's great and you, you went swimming this morning and you're like, ah, this is like, I'm so happy here. This is the best, I'm so happy. Oh, I feel guilty that I'm so happy about this. Well, it's like the data will change anyway. The data, all the experiences, all the thoughts and feelings, they're always changing. So there's nowhere really to find that relaxation other than in resting naturally because that's where the relaxation is uncontrived and always on. So this, this has just been amazing for me, amazing for me to just hear, just to hear that there's just something about me that's open and relaxed all the time. And then it was really an adventure testing that out in the beginning. So okay, things that I hated feeling, nervous and anxious. I'm nervous right now. So feeling nervous, can I relax whilst feeling nervous? And what was incredible to see is that taking short moments with any, any kind of data stream, we get to see that the data stream resolves naturally like the flight path of a bird in the sky. Wow. Nervousness, not on 24-7. Open intelligence, on 24-7. Because every time I took the short moment with that thing <laughs> that I really didn't want to think or feel, 
I confirmed to myself open intelligence is there. And I also was able to gain assurance that the data stream would resolve naturally, like the knot in a snake undoes itself. And this is amazing. This is true freedom. This is true freedom in the immediacy of whatever appears. So this is the relaxation we really, really want. We really want to know that no matter what's going on for us, and we all know that all, all kinds of things go on for us. Okay, we, we, we just know. We know because we know it in ourselves. We know it from our friends and family. We watch the news. We know things happen. Things happen. Circumstances happen. We have all kinds of thoughts and feelings about everything. So just to know that we can just test relaxing for short moments with everything, we get to taste this, this true freedom. And what I found especially doing the 12 empowerments and really looking at all my relationships in my life and seeing where I'd basically acted out all these thoughts and ideas I had about those relationships and about myself in those relationships, I started to see that, wow, I can relax. I can relax with all of those thoughts and feelings about those people. And what I started to see was that I had this other option. I finally had this other option. So like relationships, do you have those relationships where it just feels like, you know, it's just the same pattern comes up in those relationships? It's amazing. I had, you know, you, you feel, okay, it's good, you know. Okay, I, I remember traveling for like a year. I traveled for the year. I felt, okay, good. I feel good. I feel ready to go back to my normal life, go back to my normal life you know, hang out with my family in literally 20 minutes. I'm like, I can feel all these, you know, responses coming back. And when I did the 12 empowerments, it was amazing because I went home, felt all those triggers, but there was just this moment where I knew I could just take that short moment with the irritation, with the guilt, with, with all the stories that had just been, yeah, I just carried around so many stories. And that was a really powerful moment. So I really feel like just the incredible benefits, just in simple everyday life with this training, with doing the 12 empowerments, to just cut so many repetitive stories and habits that were, you know, not making me happy. They were not making me happy. I wasn't feeling fulfilled and satisfied. You know, it was just more tension. It was more, you know, we just want, we just want to get along. We just want to get along with each other. We want that more than anything. You know, maybe that's why we're here now. Maybe that's why we ask the questions we ask. Cause we just want to know this harmony and this way of being that we just know is possible. We know is possible and then and then we get the opportunity to just try a new way of relating, a new way of relating to ourselves, a new way of relating to our own data stream, our community and family of data, the thoughts, the experiences, the party, the party of data, the wild party of data. We get to get comfortable with ourselves exactly as we are. Recognizing open intelligence for short moments whenever we remember, nothing to force. We're done with that. We want an easy, we want an easy life now. We want an easy way to be with ourselves in the world.